Denise Welch, 63, has taken to Twitter to rant at her ITV colleague Dr. Hillary Jones' comments on television this morning. The post was a response to a tweet put out by Good Morning Britain. This featured a video of Hillary discussing the fact that science for the large part fully supports the vaccine. He explains that someone who is unvaccinated carries the virus in their bodies for longer. The presenter warned that doctors have an ethical duty to protect patients. The caption for the video read, The vast majority of doctors and scientists think the science is plenty strong enough to support vaccination. At DR Hillary Jones warns someone who is unvaccinated can carry the virus for longer and there is an ethical duty for doctors to protect patients. Denise replied saying that she believed there was a lot of fear-mongering going on. She added that many people would never recover from the effects of the pandemic on certain people's mental health. In full, her tweet read, also important that people responsible for nearly two years of fear-mongering should be more aware of the impact on mental health. Sick, some people will never recover from the ridiculous lives they have been leading. The tweet was released to her 510,500 followers. Some of her fans were quick to come to her support. Many Twitter users were equally as angered by the doctor's statements. Dot at Lindsay underscore Lockett wrote, They need to stop giving this man airtime, has he got shares in Pfizer? I caught COVID, very little symptoms didn't pass it on to my husband who is vulnerable my kids or work colleagues and am not vaccinated. No wonder at high TV received complaints about his misinformation. At MCNFTZ said, well said. All he has done is sit on various seats telling folk how scary COVID is. Is he even a doctor? Some fans took issue with Denise's comments, though. At Miss Dross 72 penned, all you do on this is moan. Denise was quick to bite back, saying, there is an unfollow option Miss Ross. Similarly, Olivia 06012016 spent, that man has saved lives. Not only now but all his life. In the height of the pandemic you clapped him now you say he is putting patients at risk. You are fickle. A disgrace. You have no heart. His body his choice.